Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. The Pike County Detention Center is hoping to increase revenue through the housing of federal inmates. At today's Pike County Fiscal Court meeting, Jailer Brian Morris told the court that he plans to increase the amount of money charged to the federal government to house those inmates in Pike County. After delivering the draft budget for the Pike County Detention Center for the upcoming fiscal year, Jailer Brian Morris said he plans to look for ways to increase revenue. One possible avenue is through the housing of federal inmates and increasing the cost incurred on the federal government for housing those inmates in Pike County. Morris said it costs Pike County about $26 per day to house an inmate, federal or local, in the jail. The feds pays the county $35 a day for every U.S. Marshal prisoner we have. You know, and, and me and, and Dexter and Jason sit down and started looking at that. And we, we kind of we kind of researched why, why are they paying other detention centers. Morris told the court that Pike County is underpaid for housing federal inmates. He said revenue generated from those federal prisoners could increase dramatically with an increase in the fee charged to the federal government for housing those inmates. Last year, the U.S. Marshals paid the county $255,500. That's based on the $35 a day human. If I get my increase, that two fifty-five dollars is going to go for up to $438,000. Currently we house 20 U.S. Marshal prisoners and with the rate that we're billing now compared to the rate that I asked for using the same amount of numbers, you're looking at an, another $182,000 more on, on the year coming into the county. You know, knowing the, how much it costs a day to keep a uh, inmate up and, and know what they pay, I, I felt it was necessary to ask for an increase just to kind of offset the day-to-day -day expense. Morris declined to reveal at this time the amount of the increase the detention center is seeking to house federal inmates. Morris said he anticipates the government approving the request to raise the fee. In Pikeville, Chris Anderson, EKB News.